together and we're not going nowhere. Period. What up, SM Squad, and welcome back. It's your boy Sean. And your girl, Mel. What it do, SM? Favorite cup. What's up, SM Squad? How back are you in guys? The building, How are you baby? guys doing today? I hope you guys are so wonderful. Good How are vibes. you doing, Mr. Sean? Doing pretty good, baby. What about yourself? How are you doing? Doing wonderful. Doing wonderful. Great. Looking wonderful. Yes. Thank you so All much. Right, you do and too. Good Thank vibes. you. That's what I'm talking about. That's how you start the video off, y'all. Um, okay, we got Joyner Lucas. All right. I'm not racist. Wow. Wow. You know, it's crazy that we didn't get to hear this. Nope. Haven't heard it yet. this is our first time. You guys were in the comment section. Wow. And you guys asked for this one multiple times. Like, this yes. was one of those songs that you guys requested like, this was highly requested, so we had to do it today. Oh, we yeah. had to bring it to you guys. Definitely. Official. Um, before this video starts, make sure you like, comment, subscribe to the channel, y'all. And also turn on your post notification bell. All right. This guy spit fire. So, okay. you know, I'm, I'm guessing that this is going to be fire. Okay. But um, if y'all ready, we ready. We about to get into it. You ready, baby? Let's do Let's it. Let's go, baby. Come on now. Let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it. It's about that time, y'all. All right. I'm not racist. Okay. Not Magic racist. countdown, y'all. In five, four, three, two, one. With all due respect, I don't have pity for you black niggas. That's the way I feel. Screaming black lives matter. All the black guys rather be dead beats than pay your bills. Yelling nigga this and nigga that. Call everybody nigga and get a nigga mad. As soon as I say nigga, then everyone react. Want to swing at me and call me racist because I ain't black. We'll pound that then True. Talking about slavery like you was around back then Like you was picking cotton off the fucking ground back then Like you was on the plantation getting down back then Alright Look I see a black man aiming his gun But I'd rather see a black man claiming his son And I don't mean just for one day and you done I mean You still trapped in a rut And I work my ass off and pay my taxes for what? So you can keep living on free government assistance Food stands for your children But you still trying to sell them for some weed and some liquor Or a fucking babysitter Why you party on the road Cause you ain't got no fucking goals Woo! You already late You motherfuckers need to get your damn priorities straight Wait It's like you proud to be fake Yo. But you lazy as fuck And you rather sell drugs and get a job and be straight And then you turn around and complain about the poverty rate Fuck out of my face Woo! You can't escape problems You can pray for some change but can't break a dollar Got nobody else to blame, so you blame Donald. They fuck the world with a Make America Great Connor. Ooh. My voice been back. I'm not racist. My sister's boyfriend's black. I'm not racist. My sister-in-law's baby cousin Tracy got a brother and his girlfriend's black. My head's in the cloud. Ooh. Heard it's not enough jobs for all the men in your house. Maybe we should build a wall to keep the Mexicans out. Or maybe we should send them all to the ghetto for now. I'm not racist. And I never lied, but I think there's a disconnect between your culture and mine. I worship the Einsteins, study the Steve Jobs, but you ride Tupac's dick like he was a fucking god. Oh my god. Woo. And all you care about is rapping and stunting and being ratchet. And that's the nigga within you. Music right in your brain and slowly start to convince you. Then you let your kids listen and then the cycle continues. Blame it all on the menu. Blame it on those drinks. Blame it on everybody except for your own race. Blame it on white privileges. Blame it on white kids and just blame it on white citizens. Aim it the vice president. Damn. Watch your class clowns, niggas kneeling on the field, that's a flag down How dare you try to make demands for this money, you gonna show us some respect, you gonna stand for this country, nigga oh! I'm not racist, oh, I'm just prepared shit. for this type of war I heard Eminem's rap at the awards, who's he oh. fighting for? Y'all can take that motherfucker too, he ain't white no more oh. Just like you wanna be so famous, you'll do anything for attention and a little payment I can't take you nowhere without people pointing fingers Pants hanging off your ass, you ain't got no home training Put your fucking pants up, nigga Put that suit back on, take that do-rag off Take that goat out your mouth, quit the pitiful stuff And then maybe police and stop killing you Fuck shit, what the fuck? Woo! I'm not racist Damn. It's like we living in the same building but split into two floors I'm not racist But there's two sides of every story I wish that I knew yours Oh my lord. Mm. I'm not racist. Ooh, that went 
that one hit. Yo. That one hit hard. Woo, Lord. Damn. Oh my God. With all disrespect, I don't really like you, white motherfuckers. That's just where I'm at. Screaming, all lives matter is a protest to my protest. What kind of shit is that? Wow. And that's one war you'll never win. The power in the word nigga is a different sin. We shouldn't say it, but we do, and that's just what it is. But that don't mean that you can say it just because you got nigga friends. Nigga. That word was originated for you to keep us under. And when we use it, we know that's just how we greet each other. And when you use it, we know there's a double meaning under. And even if I wasn't picking cotton physically, that don't mean I'm not infected by the history. My wow. grandmama was a slave. That shit gets to me, and you ain't got no motherfucking sympathy, you pussy nigga. Ooh. Damn. I'm sorry you can never feel my life. Trying to have faith, but I never feel all right. It's hard to elevate when this country's ran by whites. Judging me by my skin color and my blackness. Trying to find a job, and ain't nobody call me back yet. Now I gotta sell drugs and put food in my cabinet. You crackers ain't slick. This is all a part of your tactics. Don't talk about no motherfucking taxes. When I ain't making no dough, you think you know everything, but you don't. You wanna copy our slang and everything that we know. Try to steal black culture and make it your own. Whoa. Fuck, I'm exhausted. I can't even drive without the cops trying to start shit. I'm tired of this systematic racism bullshit. All you do is fall shit. This the shit that I'm false with. And you don't know shit about my people. That's what bothers you. You don't know about no fried chicken or no barbecue. You don't know about the two step or no loose change. You don't know about no two chains or no Kool Aid. You don't know. And even though Barack was half as black, you hated President Obama. I know that's a fact. You can't wait to get him out and put a cracker back. And then you gave us Donald Trump, and I was paid back for that. I'm not racist. I never lied, but I know there's a disconnect between your culture and mine. Yeah, I praised Tupac like he was a fucking god. He was fighting for his life way before he fucking died, nigga. Die, nigga. And all you care about is money and power and being ugly. And that's the cracker within you. Hatred all in your brain and slowly start to convince you. Then you teach it to your children until the cycle continue. Blame it on Puerto Rico. Blame it on OJ. Blame it on everybody except for your own race. Blame it on black niggas and blame it on black citizens. Aim at the black businesses. I ain't saying I'm innocent, but... I might be any day now, treating everybody how you want in any way how. I swear North Korea about to bomb us any day now. And now I'm ducking every time I hear a fucking plane now. Shit. Woo! You know I make a lot of sense, but you just can't admit it. When Eminem went against Trump, that was the illest. Cause even though he's white, he let us know he's standing with us. I'm not racist, but I cry a lot. You don't know what it's like to be in a frying pot. You don't know what it's like to mind your business and get stopped by the cops. And I know if you about to die or not. You worry about your life, so you take mine. I love you, but I fucking hate you at the same time. I wish we could trade shoes, or we could change lives, so we can understand each other more, but that'll take time. I'm not racist. Wow. It's like we living in the same building, but splitting to both sides. I'm not racist. But there's two sides of every story, and now you know mine. Wow. Woo! Can't erase the scars with a bandage. I'm hoping maybe we can come to an understanding. Yeah. Agree to disagree, wow. we can have an understanding. Yeah. Wow. I'm not yeah. racist. Wow. Damn. Wow. Woo. Man. Woo! What you talking about? Chills? Whoa, Nelly. Oh, man. That was deep. Oh. That one took me on a that ride. That one right there was more than worth it, man. Woo. And I have to say, the two guys in the video conveyed the message that Joyner Lucas, Lucas was saying so well. Oh, yeah. They did an awesome job. And wow. Um, wow, for artists to tell two perspectives yes. in one song, man, is amazing. And nailed it down to a T. Oh, yeah. How each each group, yeah. you know, feels about yeah. certain subjects, certain topics, as far as race goes. Yeah. And <clears throat> that was deep. Yeah, I mean, you got to take your head off to him, man. That was so deep because... You know. Until you really get to sit down and talk about the differences, have the conversations. That's why I love this platform because we get to have these conversations. We, you know, we yes. need to have these conversations because we are so ignorant to different cultures and different ways. And until we come together, yes. we are always going to be divided. And 
Absolutely. Wow. And once we understand that we can agree to disagree, you know, we better off, you know. Wow. Um, that was so powerful, though, man. Good wow. job. Good job. Joanna oh, Lucas. my goodness. Amazing and job, man. At the end of the day, wow. we just have to have enough luck. We it enough respect, at least respect, because everybody is not. It's not realistic that everybody's gonna just have love. Some people don't even have love for their own race. Amen. You know, so everybody's <laughs> not gonna have love, but okay. you know, just some respect for the differences because the differences is what makes you spe. The differences are what makes you special. You know. Yeah. They make you special and. Um, Wow. And it's crazy because we all got to live here in America. So, you know, we can't be divided, man. And you know what? Racism goes beyond America. Racism is in other countries also. So it's not just America. Like, I feel like this war between white and black has everybody in the world, like, feeling some type of way. You know? It's crazy, man. It is. But I really feel like the cycle is ending. You know? I feel like the cycle is flushing out. That's just my opinion. You know, things are changing. You know, day by day. Things are changing. Things are getting better. Yes, things are, well, things are going to get better. You know? I, I love learning about, you know, white culture. Oh, yeah. That doesn't mean that I'm not respecting my own culture. It just makes me, it makes me aware. Like, who wants to be ignorant forever? Yeah. I love it. I love you know, this new journey that we are on, it's amazing. I have so much respect for the culture. Oh, yeah. And, you know, I love my own culture. I love being a black woman. I love being black, period. I love oh, yeah. my culture. I wouldn't trade it for anything. I don't care. I wouldn't trade it. And I hope that everybody would feel so good in their own skin because that's who god made you to be created you absolutely your own skin who you are and your skin does not define you but is a part of you so let's be better than our color you know let's just be more i hope you guys definitely enjoyed this video it was definitely you know it gave us a whole bunch of knowledge of what's going on but um, we got to sign off, you guys. We definitely had a blast. Hope y'all had a ball. You know, and let us know definitely. in the comment section what you guys think. Um, it took us a while. Wow. This came out a while ago. Bravo, Joanna wow. Lucas. You but are. Definitely take my hat off. You know, I salute. Amazing Joyna with Lucas. your words, putting everything together. Oh, if yeah. a, a one amazing. man can put together two perspectives so well. That's amazing. That means he's well-rounded. He has respect for everyone. And we all should be like that. I oh, love yeah. that so oh, much. Yeah. So big ups to you, Joyna Lucas. And big ups to the s and squad. s and squad, I love you baby. guys. I Make love sure you Make sure y'all all. get this video a big fat thumbs up. Let's keep it in high rotation, yes. baby. And thanks for watching, you guys. It's your boy, Sean. And your girl, Mel. I love you all. I love you guys. Favorite couple. Everybody be safe. s and stand S&M. up, baby. Peace. <laughs>